Hi folks, so today I'm going to show you how to add a bash to Windows 10 Insider Preview build 14316. As you may or may not know, Canonical and Microsoft work together to make this possible, and uh, this is how you can enable it. So to begin, right click on the start menu and select programs and features. Now select Turn Windows Features on or off. In the new window, scroll down until you see Windows Subsystem for Linux. Check that and click OK. That will now install and prompt you to reboot. And when you're ready, click Restart Now. So as it shuts down, Windows will start installing the Linux subsystem and following the reboot will finish it off. Just wait for this to finish. And when it's done, we can log in again. Now the Linux subsystem has installed, we'll continue to install bash. Open the command prompt when you're ready and type bash. Then type Y to confirm. Windows will now download the necessary files from the Windows Store. This can take a little while, so I've sped it up. Following that, it'll extract the file system. Again, this can take a long time, a good 3-4 minutes, and I've sped that up a little bit here. Okay, ignoring the error, bash is now installed and as you can see you are root at localhost. That's essentially all there is to it. To launch bash, once it's installed, open the command prompt and type bash. Once again you are root at localhost and you can run any Linux commands you deem fit. Thanks for watching.